Here's how to change volume spacers in your rear shock. Start by recording the shock pressure, then removing all the air. Now grab the air can and unscrew it from the rest of the shock. If necessary, use an old tube or piece of rubber to grip the can. We recommend placing a rag at the bottom of the shock to protect the frame in case the can pops off while unscrewing. Now slide the air can partway down the shaft, making sure not to pop it off the bottom to avoid spilling the float fluid that is inside. Slide the bottom out bumper and metal washer down far enough that you can insert your volume spacer flat side up and push up until it clicks into place. Now slide the washer and bottom out bumper back into place and slide the air can back up. Compress your suspension to make it easier to screw the air can back into place, air up your shock, and you're done.